If you have no programming experience and you want to be a web developer from your zero experience, I will give you 10 steps so that you can follow these steps as a guideline and be a web developer as fast as possible. So the first step of this guideline is you have to learn HTML and CSS because HTML is the fundamental block of creating web page. You have to know how to use hypertext markup language or HTML to create web page. And then you have to know the fundamental of CSS or cascading style sheet that means you can style the HTML content. So you have to know both of these. At the second step, you have to learn JavaScript. JavaScript is the only language that runs inside a web browser. So using JavaScript, we can create dynamic content in our web page so you have to know how javascript works and you have to know the fundamental of javascript very well at the third step you can choose any backend language like php or python you may ask me that why we need another language to create web application Using JavaScript and Node.js, nowadays you can create backend web application as well. But I suggest that if you learn more than one language from the beginning, it will help you to go further in your career. So either choose PHP or Python and in long run you will get more help and benefit. And at the fourth step, you have to learn any web application framework so that if you uh, choose PHP or if you learn PHP then you can see the Laravel which is a very popular framework nowadays or if you learn Python then you can use Django web framework to create web application there are some other frameworks as well but I suggest these are popular frameworks so it's much better to know how this popular framework works and if you do not select PHP or Python then you can use Node.js based framework like Express. At the fifth step you have to learn the SQL or structure query language because you have to know how to store data in database and relational database is a fundamental knowledge every web developer have to know. Nowadays there is also no SQL is using but still you have to know how the structure for a language works. And for this purpose you also should know uh, either MySQL database management system or PostgreSQL management database management system. At the sixth step you have to know Git and GitHub. You have to know how to use other people's code in your project. You have to know how to submit your code as an open source or how to submit your code for a company so that they can check it out and other developer can work on that. So you definitely have to know how to version control of your code. So uh, for this purpose, you should definitely know Git and GitHub as well. At the seventh step, after knowing all these basic things, you should create some web project. So, I suggest create very little things like you can create hello world project, you can create a simple login project, simple sign up uh, web page so that you can know the how the fundamental of these things work, how can the uh, database connectivity is working, how uh, data goes from the back end web application to uh, database management server like this you have to know the fundamental of the things and so that you can improve your skills of this based on this basic knowledge at the eighth step you should learn any modern javascript based framework like you can choose react library or angular framework or view framework and these libraries are nowadays very popular to create single page web application so you should definitely know at least one of these framework to be a web developer at the ninth step you should create more projects so all of the knowledge you learned in this guideline you now have to create more and more projects so that you can showcase as a portfolio and you should open source some of your projects so that when you will apply any job as a junior developer or intern or if you want to apply any freelance work in that case you can uh, submit uh, your github portfolio so that the client uh, gives you uh, the client can check that what you have done before and if they impress they can give you the work and by this way you can be a web developer from zero experience i i hope it will help you to give a general guideline that how to be a web developer from zero, ex zero experience so thank you for watching